Hey gang, uh, hope you're having a great Friday and hope you have a great weekend. <clears throat> so Brett, I want to answer your question. This may be a question that several other folks have. Uh, how to create one PDF document um, with screenshots. So there's tons of applications out there to do a screenshot. <clears throat> one of the ways you can do a screenshot, like I'm on my iPhone right now, I could do that, push that button, whatever that button is, and this button at the same time, and that creates a screenshot. And then uh, just save it to photos. Could also save it to files. You can do the same thing on an iPad. So you just push this button and this button. So whatever you're viewing with your phone or your iPad, that's one easy, super easy way to create the screenshot or the image. So I don't know what device you're on, Brett. It looks like you're on, um, it looks like you may be on, don't really know. That looks like maybe an Explorer browser, but I can't really tell. <clears throat> nope, you're on a Mac. I see down there at the bottom, you're on a Mac. So dude, if you're on a Mac, it's super easy. I don't know what app you have, but I like this app called Cloud, Cloud App. So for example, <clears throat> I'm going to just use this tool right now. I think hopefully you're, you're seeing my screen and I'm just gonna grab a screenshot of your deal, your image, and I'm gonna name it. And I'm gonna download it. And I'll show you what I'll do with that image. But I just created a screenshot. I don't know how you're gonna do that because I don't know what app you're gonna use, but you definitely need an app to do that. So I'm downloading, uh, I wanna name that Brett, and I'm gonna download it right there to my inbox, a folder that I created on my Mac. So there it is. So now let's say I wanna create uh, a document. Dude, there's like a thousand ways to do this. So I'm trying to think, I'm gonna assume you have pages. So I'm gonna open pages. Um, here we go. We got pages. I'm going to create a new pages fold file new pages Yeah file and I'm just going to create a blank. You can do whatever you want. I'm going to name this uh, Brett And I'm going to save it in my inbox and let's see you can do whatever you want to create this um, Document as you can see, I'm just creating a document. But what I need to do now is I need to put an image, that screenshot. So in pages, what I would do is, I'm using Alfred here. You will have to go find yours if you don't have Alfred. But I'm gonna look for Brett. Um, Brett, there's the PNG that I saved earlier. So I'm gonna drag that right in there. And boom, there it is. So now I have a screenshot that I captured using whatever app you want to use and I saved it to my hard drive then I created a document and then I put a screenshot in there and now I've got this document called Brett and it's got to be a PDF to upload into Blackboard so I'm gonna go file I'm gonna go export to PDF and it's named Brett so I'm gonna go next I'm gonna put it in at my inbox and so now I've created a document with a screenshot I could do a hundred screenshots so now I'm gonna just go make sure that that document is what I need here it is I'm looking for Brett PDF uh, eh, I got the wrong there we go Brett PDF now that's my document it is now a PDF so I hope that helps. If, if I can help you more, uh, I'll just need you to be a little more specific about your question. But you asked if I'm getting your messages, and I didn't actually, but I'm, I'm going to tell you I'm, I'm getting you an answer now. I'll post it in group me in 10 minutes take me more than 10 minutes but anyway I'm going to now put this video on YouTube grab the link 
paste it into GroupMe. So hope that helps. Thanks for watching my little video. I'll see you next time. Take care and have a great weekend. And by the way, for those students who did submit early, you guys are awesome. I sure appreciate it. Thank you.